Israel's ability to completely control coverage of its crimes is important. 9-11 was immediately falsely linked to Iraq by Israel. And as you will see, the pre-invasion hype, the anthrax attacks, spies, and even 9-11 itself all link back to Israel. However, the U.S. was a willing partner. The U.S. wasn't fooled. It was fed a pretext, which it eagerly accepted. The plans for war, the Patriot Act, and massive profiteering had already been made and decided for years. The war in Iraq wasn't based on mistaken intelligence. It was based on lies, no deceptions. The power structure used that unity to pass nightmarish legislation, beginning with the Patriot Act, which was written before 9-11. 9-11 was the new Pearl Harbor event the neocons yearned for, and it was 9-11 that acted as the catalyst for both war and sweeping pre-written legislation to create a security panic state, which stripped away civil liberties and constitutional rights for the sake of the military-industrial complex. Homeland Security was in place prior to 9-11 as well. Another piece of this, which is something that uh, has been well known to you all, is that the creation of the Office of Homeland Security was something that was planned even before September 11th. While an international intelligence cartel wages psychological warfare against we the people. And remember, this is a government that over the years has proven that it can be trusted with these powers. You'd hope, as you mentioned before, that people don't complain about these extra inconveniences because they are simply being put into effect to protect all of us. The creation of the Department of Homeland Security, briefly called the Office of Homeland Security, an executive post-9-11 spawn before the Homeland Security Act passed later to make it officially and legally more legitimate, quietly incorporated FEMA, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, under its wing. FEMA was responsible for the 9-11 cleanup. Oddly, they were positioned in New York September 10th, the night before the attacks. But to be honest with you, uh, we arrived on uh, late Monday night and went into action on Tuesday morning. And not until today did we get a full opportunity to work uh, uh, the entire site other than the spot of church and day to which we were deployed. It's important to look at the events before, during, and after 9-11 in order to understand it. It is also important to look at who was chosen to investigate it. Two huge bills were created which have forever changed America. The Patriot Act and the creation of the Department of Homeland Security. The Congress passed these monsters while it was under the duress of an anthrax attack. 